collinear points the point a minus 6 minus 9 b 3 minus 3 and c 12 k are collinear determine the value of k so when we say collinear what does that mean so that is the first thing which you should know collinear means what right so collinear means falling in the same line so three points which are on the same line let's say these are my three points then they are on the same line then they are collinear do you understand that means if i draw a line i can connect all the three points with a straight line that is the meaning of collinear now let's read the question to understand what we are trying to do points a and b and c are collinear so let's say these are my points a b and c let's just write a b and c here right now determine the value of k so point a is given to us as minus 6 minus 9 point b is given to us as 3 minus 3 and c is given to us as 12 and k so if these three points are collinear we need to find the value of k that is the question so basically what we should do here is using a and b we will find the equation of a line and in that equation we'll substitute x as 12 and find y value that should help us right so with this strategy let's start solving this question so finding equation of a line given two points that we can do in two steps first step is find slope between a and b which is y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x1 in this case y2 is minus 3 minus y1 is minus 9 or x2 is 3 minus minus 6 it's good to use these brackets right now let's open these brackets and then solve so minus 3 plus 9 over 3 plus 6 that gives us 6 over 9 right so that becomes the slope now we can solve it further dividing both by 3 to so get 2 over 3 so m is 2 over 3 for us now we can write the equation of a line as y equals to 2 over 3x plus b how will you find b to find b we can use any one of these points so let's take 3 minus 3 it helps because 3 and 3 will cancel out right so we'll use the point 3 minus 3 in this equation so minus 3 is y value 3 is x value so we get minus 3 equals to 2 over 3 and the x value is 3 plus b so we get minus 3 equals to this cancels out you get 2 plus b and from here you can solve for b so we get minus 3 minus 2 equals to b and so b is equals to minus 5 correct so once you know what b is you can write down your equation so your equation now becomes y equals to 2 over 3x and b is minus 5 so let minus 5 here. so that is the equation which represents a line through points a and b now if c is collinear it should be on this line correct so we are given x value of c that is 12 so we'll substitute 12 here and find what y is rather we could also say y should be k so we'll write instead of y we'll write k here now right so k equals to 2 over 3 and the x value is 12 so we'll write here times 12 minus 5 now this could be simplified right so this goes 4 times is it okay so we can write k is equals to 2 times 4 minus 5 so k is equals to 2 times 4 is 8 8 minus 5 which is 3 for us so that is the value of k and therefore we can write down the answer that is c should be 12 3 right so that should be the point so the answer is that k is equals to 3 that will ensure that the point is on the line and then they are all collinear right i hope you understand the method by which we have done it let's recap and let's see how, what we did here so first we understand collinear means that three points are collinear means that they lie on the same line now we are given two points we can find equation of a line using the two points once you get the equation you substitute the x value of the third point find the y value which is unknown k that becomes the unknown value for us and only for that value of k that is only for k equals to 3 this point is collinear 
for any other point, any other value of k, this point will not be collinear, it will be not on the line but somewhere else. I hope that's absolutely clear to you, right? Thank you.